Hi everyone, Rhonda Robson with Rhonda's Try Artistry and we're gonna use the color wheel again today. And today we're gonna to be using split complementary colors. So when you're doing your color wheel and you notice that the red has the very top, is on the very top, the split complementary colors are the triangle. So the complementary colors, the split ones are this one, and this one. And so we're gonna work with that today as well. And I'm gonna show you utilizing fluid art techniques. So let's get you down on the canvas, but don't forget to subscribe and to click that notification bell and tell me if you've used this and how you utilize it, especially with the split complementary colors. All right, let's get you down on the canvas. Bye for now. Okay, everyone. So I've got it set up. And as you can see, I'm going to use six canvases um, for the split um, complementary colors. And what's so cool is that um, each one of these has the primary, and I don't want to say primary, but the um, true color, like the yellow, the green, the blue, the red, the violet, the orange. Okay, so each one of those has that. So this is blue, this is the green, yellow, orange, red, violet. But then with the split um, complementary colors, it's, it's interesting how like, so the blue, okay, and then you've got the yellow orange, and you've got the um, red orange. They are the actual complementary colors so like the red orange is the complementary color for the green or the split complementary or the yellow orange is for the purple. So um, it all goes together. Um, it's really cool how that, that kind of um, flowed together. So each one of these, I'll be doing three, three, these three, those three, those three, and then those three. So um, anyway, all right, well, let's get started. And, and I think we'll do a Dutch board because I have all of the white. All right, we'll be back in just a second. All right, so we're gonna do a Dutch pour using the yellow as the true color, and then red, violet, and blue, violet as the split complementary colors. So um, this should be kind of cool to see what this looks like. So let's start with the blue in the middle. I didn't like the look of the Dutch pour, so I'm gonna go back and try to swipe it. But then I realized I made it too muddy, so that's why I started over again with the swipe. All right, I'm back. So this one is the green split complementary colors, 
which means it's green and red violet and red orange uh, or red yellow I think red orange red orange all right Yeah, I like that. That's cool. So we'll see if this even stays. <laughs> That's what I was trying to get was that lacing. Glad I kept trying. can see the differences in the colors and how they go better much better with this swipe Okay, so here we're at now with blue. So blue's um, split complementary colors are yellow orange and red orange. So that's what we're gonna put on here. And I'm gonna do one more Dutch plur and then I'm gonna do swipes with the other ones. So that's what we're looking at right there. I wanted to see something like that though. It's nice to see all the colors um, and not just all the white. Oh, pretty. Anyway, all right, so that was the blue.
Okay, so this next one is um, for violet, which is purple. And then this split complementary colors is yellow, green, and yellow, orange. And so um, we're gonna do a swipe this time um, with paper towels. So. Start and swipe this way. I think doing a swipe is a little bit easier to see. Okay, so in this video, we're going to do another swipe with red being the true color and then yellow, green, and blue, green um, being the split complementary colors. Okay, so last one of the split, it is um, the orange and we will use violet blue and then um, uh, blue green. So those will be the colors on this one.
go this way this time first. Cool. Thanks for watching and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so that way you can get notified when I have a new video up. Thank you for watching and have a great day.